This game is so stupid. I love this game so much. I have clocked in, I guess, 125 hours now between the betas and the actual game. And look at that. That's ridiculous. You know, I love so many characters in this game. I love Mercy for her revives, how she can just change the tide of a fight. You know, and she does pretty decent damage with her primary as well. I love Lucio and his crazy mobility. For support to be able to be this mobile is just... It makes support so much more fun. And I love 76 too. That's the only time I've ever gotten an air shot with 76. But other than that, like his raw damage output and the fact that he can place down a heal and help his teammates or his support out, or maybe keep a mercy on damage buff instead of healing so that he can get more damage out, that's just, that's great. And Senyata, by far the worst support and not a great damage class, but holy shit is he not the most fun thing ever. <sighs> he just needs more health. And that's the thing, is there's a little bit of balance change coming to this game, right? They're talking about nerfing with Korea, they're talking about buffing D.Va a little bit. There's definitely some minor re reworks for this game that should definitely be thought about and worked on. But overall, wow. Don't you guys like this game? Like, I haven't had this much fun playing a game in a very long time and it's definitely got that new like new game smell you know it's definitely fun to play a newer game one where you like it to be a part of the beginning but that's I mean that's part of what I was looking for in a game when I started playing TF2 the meta was already very stale you know the game had been out for about six years or seven years when I finally got around to it so to see a game in its infancy and to see how well done it is already, so many thoughtful decisions were made when making this game. And I, I don't have enough time to talk about all the things that I appreciate, all the little tiny things. So I'm going to talk about the big one. Support in this game. Being able to get away from a fight as a Mercy and a Lucio with your crazy mobility and being able to save people's lives or even bring them back to life is just way too great of a support option for you not to enjoy it, you know? Because normally it's so easy to eliminate a support. They're low health, they don't have a lot of damage output, doesn't matter. With these supports, you can make it so difficult for anybody to frag you. It's hilarious. But there aren't enough supports in this game. With how well they did on this game and how good of a job they did with making supports, there are only three proper supports. And I'm giving Symmetra a half support and a Zenyatta a half support because Zenyatta's damage output is way too high for a regular support and his heals are quite low. You really need a second healer if you're gonna run Zen. And um, Symmetra, she doesn't even have a heal. She is helpful, but she's a builder. She should really be in the defense area. They just would have only had three supports at that point. So we need another support, right? And I was thinking about what's missing from this game. And it's hard to tell what's missing from this game. This game has a lot of stuff in it. There's 21 heroes. There's not a whole lot of maps. But, you know, there's a pretty decent amount of maps, there's a lot of thought went into this game. But what I've noticed is that we don't have a support with a burst heal. Like, I'm talking take a breather kind of burst, 300 in a, like a second kind of burst, you know? Not Mercy being able to heal like a fucking champion. That's not the kind of burst I'm talking about here. In fact, Roadhog is the only person who seems to have a burst type heal. Everybody else is fairly gradual or non-existent. So I think we should have a support that does a burst heal and maybe some very low damage, maybe even just a damage over time. And I, I want more high mobility in my supports. I haven't really put a whole lot of thought into mobility. I think it should definitely have a cooldown. Uh, Lucio having a passive as his mobility is very cool. But he also has a speed boost. And that's another thing. Supports have healing, but there's also one with a speed boost and one with a damage boost. The only other thing I can think of is a fire rate boost. And I'm not sure if that would be helpful, if that would put, take things out of balance. There could be a lot of issues with that that I don't want to consider right now. I mostly just want to focus on the burst heal portion of it. In addition, another thing I really want to see out of this game is more ways to heal your teammates when you're not a support. Especially since we don't have a lot of supports. 76 has his biotic field where he can help his teammates out, but that's it. There are plenty of characters with the self heal, like the soul souls orb things that Reaper can have, you have the May ice block, you have take a breather obviously from Roadhog, and 76 has the biotic field. He can place down the biotic field, help his medic out, help whoever out, you know, if the med's down or something, you get a, little, a lot more sustainability when you play him, which is part of the reason I like him so much. And I want to see another offense hero with that same ability, with that same being able to help his teammates 
mana, or maybe even defense hero. Though that might make a defense hero a little too strong if they have some sort of a heal where they can heal other players, because May having a regen ability is already pretty disgusting. So imagine if Junkrat could put down the biotic field. It'd be that kind of stupid, you know? I'm not sure if this game is ready for that. But I would love to see another support in this game with a burst heal and an offense character with a way to heal. Haven't really put in any thought into anything other than supports and like things that we could add that are sort of more healing based. I'm sure there's plenty of other stuff that Blizzard's already addressing that I haven't even thought of yet. So that's everything I wanted to say about supports and healing in Overwatch for now. I want to work on a hero specific video. I left a straw poll in the description so you guys could vote on which hero you want to see a video about. It'll be a serious video or a funny video, I don't know yet. And I only selected heroes I like so I'll have something intelligent to say about them. I know this video was a bit of a longer one, it cleared out a lot of my clips, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you cuties have a great day. <laughs> <laughs>